Hello guys, I'm Bezran and welcome to the show. Hello guys, welcome. Today we're going to be doing, what yeah. are we going to be doing bud? Rhubarb and custard drumstick squashing. Nice, for a pound from the local supermarket slash corner shop slash post office slash whatever it wants to be that day. Right now, here we go. So obviously Badger Junior cheekily went to me, can we buy these? And I was like, yeah, all right then, but I've never had them before. Can we do a review? And he went, yeah, didn't you, bud? Yeah. And he's in for the kill. <laughs> okay. okay, let's try it. The Go first on. time I've tried the rhubarb. Mmm, okay. A rhubarb is nice. Is it? Try the, the custard bit. Really nice, actually. Hmm. What do you think of the custard bit? Good. Right. Now try them both together. Obviously, I don't know if you guys know, but I'm a bit of a sweet shop fan. A um, bit of a fan of these squashies ones. I think, personally, they're better than the original drumsticks. I really like these. There's something about these that I think they're just better than the original drumsticks. I don't know if my tastes have evolved, but... Yeah, they are nice. I suppose it's because they're softer and chewier and where I'm an old what's it now. <laughs> Trying to eat one of those drumsticks hurts my teeth. But yeah, these don't hurt my teeth as much and they are softer and they are nice. And try some more. Yeah. And I, I've never had the um, this flavour before. I've had the uh, bubblegum flavour. Of course, I've had the OG original flavour. I don't think I've had the rhubarb one. It works really well. Mm. Obviously, you can get in touch with them on uh, Facebook, Internet, um, Instagram, all that sort of thing. Um, the ingredients are glucose syrup, sugar, gelling agent, gelatin, modified starch, acidity regular, citric acid, trisodium cyrate, apple pulp, flavorings, glazing agents, vegetable oils, palm, palm kernel, coconut, Oh, palm. Oh, okay, not necessarily palm oil, but still. Carmo wax covers, black carrot extract, lysin and lutein and paprika extract. I don't quite know why you'd need paprika extract in here, but they must know what they're doing. What do you think of them both together? Good. Mmm, no, I'm nice, actually. Yes. I wonder why they would need paprika extract. That's interesting. Mmm. And why would you need mm. two lots of gelatin? Gelling agent and gelatin, I don't know, it's weird. Or maybe that's the same thing. But obviously if you're a vegetarian or a vegan or any sorts of uh, dietary requirements, I would check the label of everything beforehand. Go on, you can have another one. Mm. Okay, so what do they taste like when they're all twisted up? This would be interesting. Mm. Nice. Maybe it's that. What's that? Strawberries, honey, and raspberry together, they taste nice. Really? Oh, it changes the flavour a bit. That's interesting. So, yeah. you know, that's interesting. Yeah, that's okay. I quite like these. Like I said, these are nice, but personally, I prefer the bubblegum flavour. Maybe that's just the um, hubba bubba uh, 80s kid in me. I don't know. What do you try think? them twisted up. Try them twisted up. Okay, I'll try them twisted up before we go. Let's have a look. If you put... Mmm. Mmm. Hold on. Is it, was I right? Yeah, I can see where you're coming from. The flavour does change a little bit. Really nice, actually. But yeah, I would say these are nice, and I do like the original ones, but... 